Hey guys, right now I am with Ellie and we are at PetSmart. So I thought I would try to do a little vlog for you guys. I'm not sure how good it's going to be because it's pretty busy. I feel kind of silly talking to myself, but I'll just show you around the aisles. Right now we're in the small pet section. Looking at stuff. Not sure if I'm going to get too much because they don't really have any new items in. But. Ellie, are you having fun? Now, pick out some soft food. They're having a canned food sale this weekend, so I'm gonna get her a couple cans of different brands and try out. This is what I usually feed her. I might try some different ones. The Nova's supposed to be really good, so I might try that. Now we are headed to Petland to do a little bit more shopping. And Lucy's up there. We're gonna go do some shopping. Ellie's pretty excited. Hey guys, so hopefully you enjoyed that vlog. Now I'm just going to show you what I picked up today. Here is what I got at PetSmart. First I got these carnival crops. These are the veggie wedges. I got these for the guinea pigs. I've seen these a lot, but I've never picked them up. Um, they were $2.99 just for two little treats, so it's kind of expensive. But I decided I'd go ahead and try them today. They're just like a loofah treat on the outside with like an alfalfa based treat in the middle so hopefully they like them they're not a huge fan of loofah um, but i thought they might like it since it has this alfalfa in the middle next at PetSmart, i just got ellie some canned food since they were having their canned food sale all of these were two dollars a piece um the anova is usually 239 and these are usually 289 a piece so i thought it'd be a good time to try them um the anova i know is a really good brand of hard food so i'm sure their soft is just as good this is just their regular adult dog food. And then the organics are actually both, of course, they're organic and they're both grain free. So they should be really, really healthy for Ellie. Hopefully she likes them. This one is the turkey, carrot, and potato. And then I got the chicken and vegetable. So that is what I picked up at PetSmart. And then at Petland, I got a few things. First thing I got is two of these dog dental treats. Um, these are actually for my hamsters. I've seen a couple of people recently give these to their hamsters and they really seem to like them so I thought I would try it out. Um, I didn't get one for Kratos because if you know, you'll know if you're friends with me on Facebook. He is actually still at my parents house because when I came back from Christmas break I didn't have room in my car for everything. So they're taking care of him for a few more weeks until I go home to visit and then I'll bring him back. So I just went ahead and got one for Cheerio and one for Harry. Um, Cheerio actually has chewed on his already so he really likes it. So hopefully they're good. They're just vegetable based. So they're perfectly fine. They were only 99 cents a piece. So I thought I would try it out. Next I got Ellie these Nature's Choice Rawhide Treats. 
These aren't regular rawhide. These are like the chipped rawhide and then they're pressed into form. So you don't have to worry about your dogs getting off like big pieces and choking or anything. And Ellie really, really likes chewing on these. And it was only $1.49 for a three pack and they are pretty big and thick. So I thought that was a really good deal and she'll absolutely love those. And the last thing I picked up at Petland is something I've never seen before today. It is this Critterware Foraging Fun Toy. It says a delicious game of secret treat. It's on a rope and you can hook it on your bar cages. And it's just two pieces of wood with like a little clay pot in the middle. And you can actually open this up and like put a treat in there. I am going to have to use this for my guinea pigs since my hamsters don't have bars on their cages. So hopefully they'll be able to figure it out and get a tree out of there. It is pretty small so it probably would work really great for hamsters. Um, the wood on this one doesn't look too great. They only had two in the store. And I did have the other one at first but I was actually walking around the store. And I went to try to pick Ellie up and I dropped it. And the clay pot actually cracked in half in the store. Um, I'm sure everyone saw me, but I just picked it up and tried to shove it on the shelf. Um, and I got this one instead. So it doesn't look too great, but I really wanted to try it out. It was $3.49, so it was kind of expensive. So hopefully they like it. Um, so that's just everything I got today at PetSmart and Petland. Ellie had a really good time shopping, um, along with Lucy, who is my roommate's dog. Um, sorry for the shakiness of this video. I am recording it off my iPhone. Um, because for some reason my memory card is having problems and my computer won't find the files even though it recognizes the card. So hopefully I get that fixed or I'll just have to go buy a new card and hope that works. Um, so if you like these vlogs, make sure to thumbs up this video and leave a comment down below. And let me know that you like the vlogs and I can try to do more in the future. Um, if not, that is it for now and I'll see you guys next time.